Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Coretti Ortiz, and I'm the Development Manager for Ventura and Santa Barbara County. Today's nutrition challenge is, I will try to eat low sodium food at home. Yesterday, we learned about sodium and how bad it is to eat a lot of it. Today, we're gonna to go over some common foods that you might not know are high in sodium. We are going to look at the food and then we're gonna make good choices. A can of soup, high in sodium. Pizza, high in sodium. Bacon, high in sodium. Ketchup, high in sodium. Alternative foods that are lower in sodium and that are better for you are fruits and vegetables, whole grains, fish, poultry, low-fat milk and dairy, and drinking plenty of water. My choice for my meal today is chicken broth, radishes, avocado, and asparagus. Remember to eat light. Today's password is light. Today's password is light. Have a wonderful day. Hello everyone, I'm Tim Filibosi, sports manager for Santa Barbara and Ventura counties. Hope you're doing well. People are always asking me, how are we staying active right now? One, I'm drinking lots of water while doing my physical activities. And two, I am not shaving. So our hydration challenge for today, or for this week, is make sure we're drinking water before, during, and after activities. When we're active, our body needs a lot more water. So again, we need to make sure we're drinking water before, during and after activities. So our challenge today is during your physical activity, please have your water with you and take at least two water breaks during the activity. Um, I myself will be drinking two water bottles today before my activity and I'll have water during it. So again, we wanna thank you all. Hope you're keeping safe. And um, don't forget to view the resource page to learn more about balanced meals and portion sizes. Again, I'm Tim Filibosi coming to you from Glee to the Goodland. Stay safe, have a great day.